Hi guys, El Jefe from the future here. I realized after completing this video that although I was capturing a 4K image, the video file was actually in 720p. As a result, you're going to notice a lot of artifacting on text and other fine details. But don't worry, this setup will look great on your 4K monitors. Hey everybody, my name is El Jefe. I'm a Twitch streamer who mostly plays Project 1999 EverQuest. You can find me right over there. And today we're going to be discussing a solution to a problem I hear expressed by a lot of new Project 1999 players. That problem being EverQuest's struggles to scale onto 4K monitors. New Project 1999 players running the game at 4K would be greeted with a user interface that looks something like this. Very small and, in my opinion, practically unusable. But with a few steps, I can show you how to turn this into something more usable like this. So let's get started. For this procedure, you'll need one link which is listed below in the description of the video. Now we are making use of a custom UI created by Shock on the EQ interface website. I'm gonna come over to this button over here and click download. After that, you're gonna wanna open the resulting zip file. Next, find your EverQuest directory. Mine is located at C, Program Files, EQ Lite. Next, drag the Velius folder into your UI Files folder. It's going to ask you to replace the files in the destination. Go ahead and OK that. Click the box that says do this for all current items and click continue. Next, go ahead and launch EverQuest using your preferred method. All right, as we can see, it's already starting to look a lot more playable. My inventory is an acceptable size. All the fonts are fairly readable, um, but this chat box down here still not looking great. First thing I'm gonna recommend that you do is type slash chat font size and then we're going to do six that makes a heck of a big difference the second change we're going to make is getting rid of this transparency we're going to come to the window drop down by right clicking on the main chat window then you're going to go to the background drop down and finally texture. Go ahead and click texture. And that's not very good, but we're going to go ahead and do the same thing again. Right click on the main chat window, go to background and then go to tint color. Now I'm going to go ahead and drag these all to the left. And there we go. Usable real 4K E99. I went ahead and removed transparency from all visible windows just for a little bit more of a visibility boost. And honestly, I could use this as my daily setup no problem
If you found this video useful, please like and subscribe and let me know in the comments what topics you'd like to hear me cover in the future. Don't forget to find me at twitch.tv slash El Jefe, and I'll see you in the next video.